Hi, in this tutorial I will show you how to create your own dissolve material that looks like this. First create a new material in the content browser and give it a name. Open the material and change the blend mode under material to mask. I will first create a vector parameter with a color that should be the base color of the material. Now I will create another vector parameter node. This one is the dissolve color. Drag the top pin of base into base color. Now I will change the base color and the dissolve color. You can change them again later in the material instance. Create a texture parameter 2D node for the noise that we will use. Under a parameter you can now choose your noise. If you don't have any specific noise that you want to use, you can just choose the default noise from Unreal Engine itself. So next pull out the RGB pin of noise and create a add node. The lower value of the add node should be minus 2. Create a scalar parameter and name it progress. The higher this value is, the more of the dissolve you will see. You can call it later in your blueprint. Pull out the pin of progress and create a multiply node. Set the lower value to 4. Now pull out the upper pin of the add node and create another add node, which is added to the lower value. Drag the pin from the new add node and create a saturate node. Drag the pin from the saturate node and create a frag node. And drag the pin out of the frag node to create a subtract node. Set the value of the subtract node to 0.6. and pull out the pin of the subtract node and create a sine node. After the sine node comes a multiply node and the B value of the multiply node is set to the dissolve color we created at the beginning. Pull the pin out of the saturate node and create a minus 1 node. Now drag the result of the minus 1 node into the opacity mask and the result of the multiply node into the emissive color. And that's it for the material. Now let's look how to modify it. The higher the progress value, the more you see of the dissolve effect. Let's save everything and create a material instance. Here we can change the base color and the dissolve color on the right, as well as the progress and the noise texture we used. Back in the material, you can change the B value of the subtract if you want to see more of the dissolve color. But that's it for the tutorial. If you want to support me, like and subscribe. Bye!